Hey everyone. So it's Saturday y'all and I don't think I have picked up the camera all week. Y'all won't maybe notice that. So I take that back. Monday is whenever I did my grocery haul video. And it's just been a weird week and I feel like I've got so much to like catch up on. Um, one, it just this week went by very, very slow. Like every day kind of felt like Friday, but it wasn't. Even like I was talking with one of my friends and they were saying the same thing. So it wasn't just me. I don't know, something's in the air. So so first and foremost, I got a haircut on Monday actually. Um, so I chopped off a lot. It feels weird. I'm still kind of getting used to it. Um, so styling it, you know, just a little different and just trying a few different things, but it will be nice and cooler um, with it getting hotter out. Today it's actually supposed to be up to 80. Y'all, we go straight from, I mean, y'all will laugh at me for saying winter, but winter to summer, like it, it gets hot real fast here. So I also want y'all to experience this with me. Nathan is at the property right now, like right this second. He actually has Peyton and Jackson with him. They're working on that project that we will share soon. And Taylor and Addie are actually at church. They have a, a thing that they're helping with at church. So he took just Peyton and Jackson with him to help him. We didn't want to take the little kids out there again. I mean, you know, it's just, there's not a ton for them to do and it gets hot real fast. Um, so he is focusing on the project and then we will meet up later. But the house is set. It's not completely like all the finishing details, but it is put together and they were able to go inside it. So Nathan, Jackson and Peyton have been inside the house now. So just like a refresher, you know, we bought this model of a manufactured home based off of a floor plan. So we didn't actually get to walk it. Nerve wracking y'all. I mean, I still feel like we have a good grasp on things, but I just can't wait to go inside of it. And then we went out on Sunday, hoping, you know, every, it, the house was put together so that we could see the inside and it wasn't, which is, you know, it's fine, but it is now put together. So Nathan, you know, called me, he's like, I'm inside. I was like, oh my goodness. So it's neat that I was there with the kids seeing the house put onto our property. And Nathan is there with a couple of our kids and gets to see the house. I wish that we could all do it together, but it's life too, you know, um, doing the best that we can with what we've got. Um, so I'm going to go out there later on with the kids. We actually have a birthday party out in that area this evening. So that's part of the reason um, for us waiting as well. I'm trying to save on gas now because you know it's up to like three fifty a gallon again. I'm like, um, so anyways, exciting. I can't wait to see the inside. I'm going to share some of it with y'all. I'm going to wait and do like a full, I'm, my plans are to do like a full empty house tour. We'll see um, once everything is put together and finishing touches. So Nathan said, you know, there's obvious that they still have some work to do. Um, but you know, at least I get to see, maybe I'll show you all the kitchen. I don't know. We'll see what happens. I'll probably be too excited and show y'all everything. <laughs> so the kids that I have here, we're not going to head out there until like three ish. So I'm just going to take care. It's Saturday. So we're kind of just having a leisure day, which is nice. Kids are outside playing because it's so pretty. Um, just getting a few things done. I'm going to give y'all an update on my seeds that we started. Y'all, it's been two weeks and it is crazy how much they have grown. That's so fun to see. Um, but can't wait to get out there and oh, see the house. You want to say hi? What's coming up? This. This? Your... The pink thing. The pink thing? Your My wedding. Yeah. <laughs> you so excited. I don't want to be that fast. You don't want to be that fast? No, I do want to. Oh, you want it to be fast. Yeah. He is so excited for his birthday. We we got a plan that it's in two weeks. It'll be one week. Yeah, and then one week. Then zero. And then zero, yes. Then it'll be my birthday. Yep, then it'll be your birthday. Okay, so I'm going to... But I have a pepper one and zero. Yep. Nope, not yet. So I'm going to show y'all the seeds and how much they've grown. Here is a seed update. I do need to water these. So today's Friday. It'll be two weeks tomorrow that we planted these. Isn't that amazing? So there's tomatoes. There's a little guy popping up. These are the zinnias. These are cosmos. And then you can see a little tiny tomato popping up there. And these are hard plants down here. Yep. 
and I'm going this, flowers. yeah, I think is another type of tomato. Because y'all know I didn't label them. <laughs> and this is cucumbers, and this is sunflowers. Those are getting kind of leggy. I know. I'm about to go into a flower. And then that's basil. Mm -hmm. And then these are some plants that we got, and I got at mint. a field trip. Yeah, this is mint basil. You want to eat one? I already ate one. You want to tell them what it tastes like? It tastes like mint. Yeah. So mint basil. Have y'all ever heard of it? That's how come it's I had to get it. It is edible. And I got lavender. Yep, lavender. Here's lavender. Mm -hmm. Which lavender I have not been successful with. But they told me that this was a special lavender and it shouldn't die. <laughs> so I bought it. <laughs> and we got fig. I'm so excited to plant that. Mom, I heard um, before um, y'all used to have a full wheel, but it was like a, the Jeep, like, um, what are y'all doing? From Bluey. It was kind of like the Jeep. Oh, yeah, we did. Mm. So that's pineapple sage. And then this is a different type of oregano. That was Kimmy's what she Yep, she picked that one out. It smells really good. And then, because I didn't have enough, yesterday, Reagan and Drew and I planted several different types of things. We've got different peppers, flowers. What is this? A not a pino pepper. Um, so it's like jalapeno, but without the heat. Look, this is so cute. Drew liked to hop or right on the cups. So this is holy basil. Um, what is this? Zinnias. So let's see one here. This is a good Drew writing. <laughs> he was trying to copy what I told him to put. So this is sweet basil. So he put sweet basil. <laughs> so excited to see these guys pop up. All right, it's time to go. I think everybody's in the van. Excited to go see the house. We're here. <laughs> oh. Can't wait to see the inside. I'm so excited. This is the kitchen. Yeah. What do you think? This is the kitchen. Feels bigger than what I thought. Mom, imagine you're making bread. Yes. There's so much room. Oh, I'm so excited. Look, there's a little shelf above oh, the fridge. Oh, I am so excited about that. that? It'll be cute to decorate. Oh, mom, I think yeah, it's a mosquito hawk or moth or something. It's fine. Oh yeah, no, this isn't a gas stove. It's just an electric stove, which I have not had a coil burner in a long time. Can I open it? Duck in it. Yeah. Yeah. Looking out the window. You see the cows? The cow was yeah. closer. Oh, it's the baby one. So we're trying to decide on bedroom stuff. Not 100% sure what we're going to do. I know. Into the yeah. Hey, baby, come here. Mom. Right there is where you can hang my chicken chandelier. Mom. <laughs> Mom. Mom. Right there is where you can hang my chicken chandelier. I guess he has no comment. <laughs> Gotta keep him on his toes. <laughs> okay, so here's the living room. Look, there's a cow out the window. I love it. <laughs> Say hi, cow. Okay, so oh, it's not, you know, the finishing work has to happen. Some pieces, like the siding for the side of the house is sitting there. In the kitchen, y'all, it feels so much bigger than what I thought it was going to. I am loving it. Um, the... I thought there was a cow out there. There's not a cow out there. It was just the tall grass that was moving. Dining room. I don't think my china hutch is going to fit, which stinks, but I mean, that is okay. Yes, at least we have a house. Very good. Um, so exciting. Look inside the cabinet. So I showed you all the little shelf up there. I love that. Let's open this. I like the hardware. I actually really like the color of the cabinets. Oh, you're right. Yeah, I know. So I was thinking of doing my coffee area here, I think. Yeah. And then we will do like 
the utensil holders over here. Drew's flexible. He yes. can do a cartwheel and a handstand, but I can't. <laughs> mm. Let's close this and get this rubber band back. And your oh yeah, we definitely could do spices there. And the oil and stuff. Where yep. we put the bowls and plates in? That's oh, a good question. Those. So one of these will be cups. Probably this one. Yeah. And then one of them will be bowls. Maybe I should do coffee over here. It just feels like it's kind of too far out of the way. No. <laughs> Is there I an outlet that. over here? Yeah. Okay. I just love this little thing. Mom, right here. we could just, um, like, um, we should have, um, I can use some meat clippies. Yeah, we need Look two dishwashers. I know. I told the kids, do not climb in here. <laughs> I know it. You can put your pots in here. Yeah, I could. Play. Yeah. Good idea. We will. Uh, we can play around. We can move stuff around. Do whatever we want. Buy animals. <laughs> Buy animals, yeah. Horsies. Horsies? Okay. You want a horsey? Three. Just three. Yeah. Five ducks. And five ducks. More. So I started this video sitting here and I'm going to end this video sitting here. So, so excited. I gave y'all a little sneak peek of the house and just sharing some of it with y'all. Went through and saw everything and y'all the kitchen feels so much bigger. It is so much bigger than what I thought that it was. Like I am thrilled with that. That island is huge. I'm just, that's exactly what I, I feel like a kitchen island just makes a very big difference with the flow. As far as like just getting a lot of cooking done, I don't know. My old house had a kitchen island, so I was, you know, just kind of accustomed to that. Um, and just, I was just thinking of where I'm gonna put certain things in the kitchen, and I'm gonna have to get rid of a good bit of like furniture stuff. Um, I don't think my china hutch is gonna fit. I could try it, it doesn't hurt to try, and then we can see. Um, and we're just trying to figure out, we're not exactly sure what room we wanna put the little girls in. And I think that we made that decision. So one of my good friends actually stopped and saw the new house. So that's why I kind of stopped vlogging while we were there. Um, and she helped me make some of those decisions and she had a very good point. So Kinley is, she's three. She's, you know, just a toddler and she gets, she, I think she's about my messiest child. She gets into a lot of stuff. And the bedroom that we're thinking about putting her in is a Jack and Jill. And she's like, a Jessica, with how much she gets into, that is not a good idea. She is going to make a mess in the bathroom. I was like, you are so smart. She's the wise woman. I was like, <laughs> decision made. She's not going in that room. We're going to put her in the other room. So anyways, and some of the things that we are going to fin finagle, we're going to make a pantry space, basically. Um, I think it will work the way that we had hoped that it would. So that's exciting. And Nathan's like, I don't think it'll be that hard to do. So just, you know, just making all the plans and stuff. So then, so this upcoming week, they're supposed to get the well out there. I got to call the power company. We still need a power pole. So, you know, like we still have some stuff. Finishing work on the inside of the house still has to happen. And the exterior. They have set the house, but the finishing work is not done. Um, but, you know, we're getting there. So, you know, a little bit leaps and bounds, big steps, baby steps, all the things. Um, I'm just so excited to just, like see it happening. And I did ask Nathan if we could get hay bale soon so I can start setting up my garden because, oh, well, I've got all these seeds now that I'm going to have to plant. So anyways, so I'm going to end this here. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with us and we will see y'all in the next video.